Today we are going to create an abandoned city like this. Open Blender, delete the light, select your cube, set the size of the Z value to 3 so you have the average size of the floor. S, Shift Z and scale it up to something like 15 meters. Switch to edit mode and make a horizontal loop cut and pull it down to a height of 0.85. Create another one and move it close to the top. Then vertical loop cuts close to each corner and 8 vertical ones for each side. Select them, Ctrl B and set the width to 0.1. Select your created squares, switch to individual origins, press E and minus 0.1. Open your shading tab and your material properties, add a new material slot and a new material and assign it to your windows. Make sure your windows are selected. Turn up the transmission and turn down the roughness. Set the base color to a complete white and name it glass. Select all outline edges, Ctrl B again and type in 0.02. Go to your modifier tab and choose a weight modifier. 0 for the X and Y and for the Z one choose 1 and with this count number you can change your floors. And with some nodes, noise and very night textures we have a cool looking all concrete look. With this technique create multiple buildings and set them in place. Then create a plane, scale it up until everything is covered your camera can see and choose a brown color for it. And then import the street I created in this video and create some cubes so the light is not shining through the building. Download this IVGen add-on and fill your scene with it. Import some cars and street signs and fill it also with your ivy generator, some trees so your scene looks overgrown. Import some grass, choose your plane and set up a particle system, weight paint your grass plane and choose under vertex groups, density and length to have a more natural grass look. And of course you can set up a character so your render have a story and make sure under your view layer properties the mist path is enabled and you set up it correctly in your world properties. And then if you hit render you just need some compositing and you have this. Thanks for watching, see you next time, bye bye.